Hello everyone, welcome back to Sadat the Achievers. So, some health issues were last one week in classes uh, regularly upload jail like So, and uh, from now onwards, the classes will be completely regular. So, the NLM goda mostly next four to five lectures for complete jail and try yes. So, already last class we started the NLM lecture. So, NLM lo, <coughs> the first lecture one completed. So, where we have discussed about the so different uh, concepts like how the different forces acts on the body how the different forces acts on the body and how do we draw the fbd free body diagram of a given body so these are the concepts that we have seen in the last class so today's class we will see what is the first law of newton's motion and what is the second law right and then next We'll see what is impulse. We'll see what is a change in momentum. And we'll see the relation between impulse and the change in momentum. So open your notebooks and start writing. So children first. So we already Newton's first law and it's a very simple definition. So write down the Newton's first law of motion definition. Newton's first law of motion. So you can. Newton's first law, it talks about the equilibrium generally. So like every body, the definition I'm writing here. So every body remains or continues, continues in the state of rest, in its state of rest or of uniform motion or of uniform motion unless and until unless and until unless and until some external force some unbalanced external force some unbalanced external force applied on the body unbalanced external force Applied on the body. So, until then, simple me go chapal and yellow on the alane under the mirror. So, the body rest loan and pony. So, me the body with the aim force applied in the door, a body rest loan under. So, other in the body motion loan and pony. So, me a body with the aim force applied in the door, a body continuous the motion loan to name under the mirror. So, every body continues in its state of rest or uniform motion unless and until. Some unbalanced external forces applied on the body. So, by the way, the external force apply here work to rest low on the body, rest low on the motion on the body, motion on the body. So, that is allow on the alane on the body. So, to simply remember, that's a Newton's first law of motion. Okay. So, until then, if the net force acting on the body is zero, Newton's first law man actually any other than that. If the net force acting on the body is zero, so then its acceleration then velocity change over that there is no change in velocity if the net force acting on the body is zero so there is no change in the velocity of the body so if the body me the velocity in change over that so can we say its acceleration is going to be zero <coughs> so acceleration is going to be zero okay na? so then we have equilibrium condition and already last class from me how to apply the equilibrium conditions and I took one question right so last law question chase and turn it root 3 kg mass this morning so tension t1 and t2 find you okay? so that that question we solved so in question would solve this as well newton's first law someone in <coughs> so the question is let's suppose a this is the inclined plane this is a inclined plane so the inclined plane mirror, now I am taking the 2 kg body here. So let me take the string. So it is fully attached. Sir. So if fully in I am taking one more block here. I am attaching one more block. So it can in the extend JC, Malik Roka fully connect JC. So e fully in again I am attaching one more block of mass 2 kg. So let it be. Uh, so, string. So, 
So let's take this angle as 30 degrees. So now let it be block A, let it be block B, let it be block C and D. So if you question it and then, so what must be the mass of block A? What is the mass of block A? So that the system remains in rest. So that the system remains in rest. What must be the block of mass of block A? So that the system remains in rest. Rest and then the total system on the equilibrium loan. So equilibrium loan and then what must be the mass of block A? Okay. Na? So you put first thing in the middle. Apply the forces acting on the bodies. Apply the forces acting on the bodies. So you put your ninjas on the ground. So, string only, whenever the string changes, the tension changes. Last class was this one. Whenever the string changes, the tension changes. So, string. mass different string. So, let the tension here it be T away from the body tension T. Away from the body tension T. So, if put tension, tension tension T the tension let it be T1 and E string low, E string low tension different to them. Madilo mass of chinga. So here also let the tension be either the string is on the let the tension be T1. So if you system rest low on the end, system rest low on the end, shall I say E2 kg block me the act of forces is done. 2 kg block key free body diagram rajan. 2 kg block key free body diagram rajan. So Above a more T act of the up. So it said down of Jesse T1 act of the So in what are the other forces that are acting? So then mass put together. So then mass of Jesse 2G mass it put down downside of the. So make last class law already Japan. Whenever a block of mass M is on the inclined plane, so you have a block of mass M inclined plane with them. So then keep weight till a downside of the. So mg gavati, mg gavati. So if you the it side of component of the mass in it side of component of So as this is theta, this is 90. So this becomes 90 minus theta. theta So this becomes mg cos theta. This mg sin theta Right? So mg cos theta is mg sin theta. So we can take it by paying force act out along the inclined plane. We can take force act out mg sin theta plus for 30 degrees angle. So 2 kg block me for what are the forces that are acting? It can above a t act of me. So below t1 act of me. So then weight will down act of me. In angles and under weight components this one. Weight components of it way possibly. Okay, it way possibly. So monarchy it way put a component on. So no need no need of the perpendicular component. So it way put a component in the so a component of chess mg sin theta which is nothing but 2g sin theta. So 2g sin theta and that's going to 2g sin theta means sin theta. So you present the PE rondu forces balance our the above forces and below forces must be balanced. T is equals to T1 plus 2g sin theta. T is equals to T1 plus 2g sin theta. So you put my name find the mass of block A find the so you T A both the if you take the free body diagram of block A, block A the free body diagram this one. So above a more T force act on you. So below a chase, let its mass be M1 kuna. So A block B, let its mass be M1 kuna. So it's Mg acts down, Mg force only down cat over. So similar ga, C block the free body diagram rather than you can change the T is equals to Mg and Rasko. T is equals to <coughs> we can write Mg. For the A block. Now C block Jordan. So tension of chase T1 up. So downside of chase then weight 2 into G. Its weight is 2, 2 kg is its mass. So, so 2G will be its weight. So you can see T1 is equals to 2G ras coach. Right? So you can see that the second 2 kg block on the 2 kg block on the T value, T1 value substitute as well. So, next line or as T is equals to T1 plus we have got 2G sin 30. T is equals to T is equals to T1 plus 2G sin 30. So, it can 
मन टी अंत चूँक टीवल टू एम जी टीवल टू एम जी टी वन वे टू जी प्लस टू जी सैन थर्टी अटे वन बै टू सो इन टू टू कैंसल सो एम जी इज ईक्वल टू थ्री जी टू जी प्लस जी थ्री जी सो इक जी जी कैंसल सो दम मस्ट बी ईक्वल टू थ्री सो एम अंटे वट इज एम सो एम इज ब्लाक ए सो मन की मास आफ ब्लाक ए मास आफ ब्लाक एज ईक्वल टू थ्री के जी सो अटे ब्लाक ए मास थ्री के जी उसे सो दिस्टम विल बी इन रेस्ट अन्ट दिस्टम विल बी इन रेस्ट अटे ईक्म लोग रेस्ट अंत क्लियर एवरी वन चल सो लैट मूव द नैक्स्ट पार्ट दिस् द न्यूटन फस्ट ला अन्ट सो न्यूटन फस्ट ला टाक्स अबउट द ईक्म कंडीशन सो बाडी ईक्म लगे नैट फोर्स ऐक्टिंग नैट फोर्स ऐक्टिंग ऑन द बाडी जीरो सो इट ऐक्सलेशन विल बी ईक्वल टू जीरो नैक्स्ट सो लैट गो फर् द्यूटन सैकंड लाफ मोशन सो पुट दी न्यूटन सैकंड लाफ मोशन सो सैकंड लाफ मोशन चाल इंपारटेंट दीन क्वेश्चन मन चाल अवसर न्यूटन सैकंड ला आफ मोशन सो आल नई पीरियड ने स्टेट न्यूटन फस्ट ला न्यूटन सैकंड ला न्यूटन थर्ड ला स्टेट आलरे ने सो इन न्यूटन सैकंड ला वाट न्यूटन सैकंड ला स्टेट सो द रेट आफ् चेज इन मूवेंट द रेट आफ रेट द स्टेट द रेट आफ् चेज आफ मूवेंट the rate of change of momentum of a body of a body is directly proportional to is directly proportional to the external force is directly proportional to the external force applied on the body external force applied on the body okay so and the change takes place and the change takes place in the direction of change takes place in the direction of the applied force in the direction of the applied force in the direction of the applied force so ante entante so the rate of change in momentum the rate of change of momentum of a body is directly proportional to external force so rate ante always per time an ardham so rate of change in momentum so what does it mean by rate of change in momentum so change in momentum vachese delta p rate ante em cheppanu per time so change in momentum by time is directly proportional to the external force is directly proportional to the f external स्टेट नक्वे द रेट मीन रेट अंत पर् टाइम बै टाइम सो चेज आफ मूवेंट सो मूवेंट पी तो डिनोट मूवेंट वी डिट इट ऐस दि पी सो डेलटा पी अस्त चेज इन मूवेंट इज डैरक्टली प्रपोर्शनल टू द एक्सटर्नल फोर्स अड्ड आ बॉडी अंड द चेज टेक्स प्लेस इन द डरक्ष आफ द फोर्स अड्डे सो मैं इटे फोर्स अस्टा सो आॉडी मूवेंट अटे चेंज सो डेलटा पी बै टी इज डैरक्टली प्रपोर्शनल टू एफ एक्सटर्नल सो दी मैं एम चाहे सो दफ एक्सटर्नल इज डैरक्टली प्रपोर्शनल टू डेलटा पी बै डेलटा टी सो इकडन फर् वेरी स्मा अमौंट फस्ट टेक द प्रपोर्शनल सिंबल अं पुट द प्रपोर्शनल कांस्टेंट ऐस के ओके so for very small change in time so ante very small change in time dt lo so the change in the momentum em avuthi dt avuthi koncham time lo the koncham change in momentum anukunta dt means the very small change in time so that in very small change in time so the change in momentum will be dp avuthad anamata so dp so ikkada nenu change chestunnanu ante nenu so f is equal to generally this k value was found out to be 1 anamata this k k value was found out to be one so directly f is equals to you can write dp by dt okay now so if you man have already momentum formula means what is the momentum formula momentum is equals to mass into velocity so ikkada em chestunnanu ante nenu 
F is equals to B of E momentum plays low. I am substituting MV by D. So you can differentiation here. So basic maths. So UV method, differentiation of MV means UV method. So UV method LIS yes, sir. So F is equals to. So first M ni constant with this one. Differentiate V. M into DV by DT plus V ni constant with this one. Throw the M ni differentiate here. DM by DT M method. So this is the actual equation of the Newton second law. So but 99% of the cases law. Man, we need to understand mass constant. This one, body the mass change over do and this one thing over the. So the differentiation of mass becomes zero on that. So F is equals to m into dv by d. So mass zero is mass constant is there. So the dm by dt is what is dm by dt means change in the mass. The differentiation of the mass term. So differentiation of the mass term will become constant over the mass zero is what is in that. Clear, everyone. So from here, f is equals to m into dv by dt. And what is the differentiation of the velocity? And acceleration. So f is equals to m a is the equation that we get from the Newton's second law of motion. So it's very important. We go IP lo gora equation define define Newton's second law of motion and derive. And deduce f is equal to m a from that and add it directly. Question four marks question. Chala important. Okay, na? so copy this one first. <coughs> Clear done. So, if you do, when a Newton second law of motion is applied, yes, that one day. Consider. Consider. So, you can block this one. Simple question this one. So, you can block this one. So, this is a rough surface. So, some surface and now surface me now. I'm taking some uh, some two kg block this one. So, if two kg block this one, you know, I'm applying this side a force of some twenty newtons. So, it will put you see some forty newtons force apply as one. Some forty newtons force apply as well. So now find the acceleration of the body. My question is find acceleration. So acceleration find the moment. So first to meet in here, body the free body diagram Rajesh Kumar. So this is just a two kg block. So a two kg block me the force is set by popular with the other one first. So forty newtons is acting right side. Then a forty newton force is acting right side, so twenty newton force is acting left side. Twenty and then left act out. So twenty newton force is acting towards left. So if you do more force, it will turn more force is towards right. And then a forty newton force is more than the twenty newton force. So come to body right side accelerate out. So force net force at either equal into the so that way too. Body accelerate out the moment. Okay, so you can put Newton second law apply. So Newton second law allow apply. So my formula is Newton second law. F is equals to m into a. So you can f one day you have to take f net and then net force of the body. So you can net force acting on the body and take. So forty m or right side act out the moment, right? So twenty m or left side act out the moment. So forty minus twenty is the net force. Which is equals to mass of the block is two into acceleration of the block. Manu find here. So it can be seen. Forty minus twenty and twenty, which is equals to two into a. So from here, the acceleration a is equals to twenty by two. So from here, acceleration is equals to ten meter per second square. So our body acceleration is seen. Ten meter per second square. Clear? Simple thing only. Understood, everyone? Sure. <coughs> so, in co question, this one, children. In co simple question, this one, children. Let's consider. Let's consider. There is some question. Let's go. If you look at surface, then only surface me the. If you look at block places, then okay. 
सो कंसीडर दिस इज़ अ 10 केजी ब्लॉक सो ये 10 केजी ब्लॉक में था मीन ऑफ़ का 100 न्यूटन्स फोर्स अप्लाई जा सकूँ आई एम अप्लाइंग ए फोर्स ऑफ़ सम 100 न्यूटन्स सो कंसीडर दिस एंगल इज़ सम 30 डिग्री संकोण विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू हारिजेंटल विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू वर्टिकल दिस एंगल इज़ 30 डिग्री सो इपुर बॉडी राइट साइड मूव Find the acceleration of the block. Find the acceleration of the block. So first and foremost thing is that first, I mean, free body diagram is called body. So free body diagram is not just one thing. So solution. <coughs> so this is 10 kg block. So 10 kg block is 100 newton force. It will act on you. सो मैं फोर्स इपड़े ना इला एक्ट आई थे रेन इला वाटर पर मन वेंज़ ऐसा आ वेक्टर निला एक्सटेंड जैसे ना ना इन द सिमिलर मैनर व्हाट यू डू इज़ सो यू एक्सटेंड दिस हंड्रेड न्यूटन फोर्स दिस साइड इपड़े ना वेक्टर इला उन्ना पड़े ये फोर्स अंदर वेक्टर गन सो ये हंड्रेड न्यूटन so that the vertically opposite angle is about 30 degrees out of so that this angle is going to be some 30 degrees so it is 30 degrees i think it is about 30 degrees out of right so now shall i write the components of force here the 100 newtons the it way put jc 100 sin 30 under it way so whereas here the 100 cos 30 will be this side okay 30 degrees it way put in the 100 cos 30 this side so it will be tied by place of <laughs> sign component will come this side. So 100 sign that way. So until the end of the day, 100 into 1 by 2. So which is nothing but 15 newtons. So it will say 100 into cos 30 will say root 3 by 2. So which is nothing but 50 root 3. So 50 root 3 newtons are downside of that. So you put it in the next question. Body right side accelerate out here. So, <coughs> body right side accelerate out in the The net force acting on the body is so 50 root 3 a more downside act out in 50 newtons a more right side act out in So, body put a right side accelerate out in So, ante maki body accelerate out in which force is responsible here. So, body right side accelerate out in the 50 newtons force a responsible. <coughs> Sorry, guys. So, if the body right side accelerate our anki, the 50 newtons force is responsible. The vertical force and the body right side move our anki responsible ga. So, na. So, if you Newton second law apply jayi, man acceleration find jayi. So, if Newton second law apply jayi, man Newton second law jayi apply the F net is equals to mass into acceleration. So, na. So, if the net force and chapan, the net force which is 50 newtons. So body is accelerating only due to the 50 newtons force. That is the horizontal low acting force only the body accelerate out. So cover F net which is so its mass which is the body mass 10 into acceleration A. So from here A is equals to 50 by 10. So from here A is equals to 5 meter per second square. So the acceleration A is equals to 5 meter per second square is the Correct answer. Clear, everyone. At the end, L apply yellow Newton's second law. So, then we have a fully question key apply a shoot is on to run a Newton's second law. Same Newton's second law. A fully question couple is shoot is on to run. Simple pulley is to run. So, which is called the Edward mission and done. The simple pulley is called Edward mission. So, consider. Concept which is you have a pulley and then you have a pulley. So, a pulley key now I am attaching a block of mass M1 here. So, which side of chasing I am attaching a block of mass M2. So, two blocks attached as well M1 block and M2 block. So, if you do, you have to find the acceleration and consider. Consider just my assumption. Be. So M2 is greater than M1 and M2 is greater than M1. 
सो अंत मास एम टू ग्रेटर अच्छे बाडी इट सैड ऐक्सलेट कौन सैड ऐक्सलेट सो एट देम टाइम एम वन बाॉडी इला अब सैड ऐक्ट ऐक्सलेट अंत नहीं ऐक्सलेशन तो डन वस्तो एम टू ब्लाक सो अंत ऐक्सलेशन तो एम वन ब्लाक एम वन ब्लाक पैक ओके सो फस्ट मेरे इक ड्रा द्री बाॉडी डयाग्रम रिप्रजेंट आल दोर्स ऐक्टिंग आन दॉडी इदंत स्ट्रिंग अवना मन को मन पोर्शन पुली एपड़ू मसल पुली अन्ट सो काबी इदंत स्ट्रिंग अन्ट सो इक टेन टी उ इकड टेन टी उ सो इकोचे एम टू जी इकडे एम वन जी इकडे एम टू जी अं एम वन जी सो इन फ्री बाॉडी डयाग्रम ड्रा चे हाउ डू ड्रा द्री बाॉडी डयाग्रम सो इन शलैसे ब्लाक ए अद्दी ब्लाक बी अंपल अडरस्टा सो इन ब्लाक ए फ्री बाॉडी डयाग्रम ड्रा चेस्ट ब्लाक ए फ्री बाॉडी डयाग्रम ड्रा चे अच्छे टेन अवना डोन सैड वे दिन वेट विच इज एम टू जी सो बाॉडी एट ऐक्सलेट सैड ऐक्सलेट वि ऐक्सलेशन एम टू मास डन सैड ऐक्सलेट सो इन ना अल्लाइ द न्यूटन सैकंड ला फर् दिश सो न्यूटन सैकंड ला एम चाहिए मन की एफ नैट इज ईक्वल टू एफ नैट इज ईक्वल टू मास् इंटू ऐक्सलेशन अवना सो इन F net. What is the net force acting on the block A? So M two G, M two G down. Acceleration net wave pulled. That wave force more on that. And then body kill the accelerate out. Kill the accelerate out. And then at the end, the M two G force on that is equal. They are going to tension pulled. And then body kill the accelerate out. So net force M what is it? M two G minus T. M two G down. Tension up. So M two G minus T. सो मे दीन मस अंत ए ब्लाक एम टू सो लैट इट ऐक्सलेशन बी ए सो इधट इट बी ईक्वे नंबर वन अके सो इन बी ब्लाक ड्रा चाहिए फ्री फ्री बाॉडी डयाग्रम बी ब्लाक टेन एबो उ टेन अप सो दिन वेट वे डन एम वन जी डन रईट अंड बाॉडी ईज ऐक्सलेटिंग अपर्ड्स बाॉडी ईज ऐक्सलेटिंग अप सो इन न्यूटन सैकंड अप्लाई चाहिए दीन की So the F net is equals to F net is equals to m into a. So if net force acting on the body is what? What is the net force acting on the body? Tension is more upside. How na? So weight is more down. So acceler body is accelerating upwards. So body accelerating upwards and the tension is greater than m one g. I am going to tell you. So net force is more than that. T minus m one g. Is equals to mass is m1 times acceleration a. So from here, uh, let it be equal. Let it be the last one. T minus m1 g is equals to m1 a. So let it be equation number two. <coughs> equation number two. So if we bring this one under, the only equations we have to write. Write these two equations at one place. So first equation is. एम टू जी मैनस टी इज ईक्वल टू एम टू ए फस्ट इक्वे सैकंड इक्वे टी मैनस एम वन जी इज ईक्वल टू एम वन टी मैनस एम वन जी इज ईक्वल टू एम वन ए सो इन टी टी गेट कैंसिल सो इन वे एम टू जी मैनस ऐडना रेक्वे ऐडना एम वन एम टू जी मैनस एम वन जी इज ईक्वल टू एम टू ए प्लस एम वन एवना सो इन इकड़ा दि सैड टेकिंग दि जी काम रईट लफ्ट सैड जी काम एम टू मैनस एम वन विच इज ईक्वल टू इन ऐक्सलेशन काम एम वन प्लस एम टू रईट सो नौ फ्रम हिर् दक्सलेशन एज ईक्वल टू जी आफ एम टू मैनस एम वन बै M one plus n. So this procedure, I'm not. This is how you should do the simple pulley type questions. This is how you should do the simple pulley type questions. So this simple pulley, ni, we also call it as the Atwood mission. So simple pulley, ni, we also call it as the Atwood mission. 
Okay. So to find the acceleration of F2 A2 mission, so the formula is M2G minus M1G by M1 plus M2. So we did this again. Now, for the shortcut, what is it? Shortcut intent. Man, if Newton second law means that F net is equals to M into A. Got it? The brain intent. M net into A net brain. So the net acceleration is net acceleration and net mass, net force. So if I say A net is equals to shall I write F net by M net F net by M net plus what? A net is equals to F net by M net. So if net acceleration A net is equals to from here. So net force. What is the net force? Sure, any first net force sure any body may act like a force. Simple ga. M two G down act out in the M one G or a down act out in the force. So, but body it it way to accelerate out in. So, shall I say? If the kinetic act a force M two G is greater than M one G, so I shall I directly write net force is M two G minus M one G by net mass. What is the net mass? Man, two blocks only M one plus M two. Okay, so I will apply short cut code. I will apply it. So the A net is equals to F net by M net. So that's the shortcut you can apply. Clear? Understood, everyone? So wait a minute. In Atwood mission, no tension find here. Learn only. So how do we find the tension? So tension key. We do direct formula put it for me. So tension. The tension formula is T is equals to two M one M two by M one plus M two times G. T is equals to two m one m two by m one plus m two times G is the formula for tension. So this is the A net and this is the tension for the Atwood mission. Our simple pulley having two blocks on it. Chinna question yes answer on the base to copy this one first. This slide and next slide copy this one. So hope everyone is getting what I am teaching here. So the concepts are very chala important. The next to me, real lecture days now. Our NLM compulsory. That will include a three body diagram, Gauss diagram, and Newton second law apply diagram. So compulsory. The concepts are very good. Next to man, so the upcoming chapter, so many people use out of them. Okay, na. So if you do that concept, you learn concept. Always learn the concept. So the concept next to na run for me. A question are you na go down? Easy का चाहिए उसको, so अभी J main सावनी बंडी, neat सावनी बंडी, N set सावनी बंडी, so मेरे ये देने exam होने हैं, so ये प्रेते में answer plus strong उन तरो, so में question solving strength वोड़ा अंते पे रुक गए, okay ना, so always focus on learning the concept, so meal ना भी strategies हो अभी भी, so अलांटी चिपकम, ये chapters मेरे को ज़रूर वाली, ये chapters तक को ज़रूर वाली सो वेट वजु सो अला बट मेरे एवते का कंपलसरी ने कासप्टर तरह प्राक्टिस डेली रिविजन उपस्ट क्वेश्चन सो कंसीडर So from here, I'm taking. You could have a 10 kg block this one. You could have a 20 kg block this one. So now my question is, find the acceleration, find the tension, find the acceleration, find the tension. So pick the video passes in the intermediate end. Very simple question. Put it just like that. So acceleration of find is sir, a net is equals to. So more force minus less force by net mass. So if we do this, one g it won't come. So ten g it won't come. Right? So twenty g is greater than ten g. Right? So that is body. If we take accelerate out of the body, what is it? It will accelerate out of it. The body what is it? Upside accelerate out of it. Right? So now net force twenty g minus ten g. By net mass, net mass which is 10 plus 20. Okay. So a net will be equals to so 20 g minus 10 g, which is 
10 g by 10 plus 20 which is 30. So from here we get a net is equals to so 10 ones are 10 threes are so a net is equals to g by 3. Okay, so let us a net is equals to 10 by 3. So my options but you can write the answer. So 3.333 meter per second square. This is a a net number. Clear? Now, so second question, how do you find the tension? You have a simple Edward mission. So tension formula in Japan, 2m1m2 by m1 plus m2 times g. 2m1m2 by m1 plus m2 times g. That is the tension formula in Japan. Right? So to direct the value of 2 into, let it be m1, let it be m2. A this man. 10 into in quarter chassis 20 by so in quarter 10 plus 20 into g g or chassis 10 right so kg 2 into 200 by 30 into 10 then so from here 0 0 cancel right so you chassis 40 400 by 3 Cover and further the solve and the options you can put that value. Clear? Understood? Everyone? So this is how you can find the tension and the acceleration of the simple Edward mission and model. Clear? Next. Next. So let's go for the next concept. So put the heading, the momentum. So let's understand the concept of momentum and impulse. <clears throat> Manaki, so momentum and already formula is what is momentum? The momentum is nothing but it's a mass into velocity. So e momentum and we denote it as a P. Momentum, we denote it as the P. So where we write the momentum formula as M into V. So, you can see momentum is the vector quantity. Remember, the momentum is a vector quantity. Remember that. So, what are the units? Units are the momentum. So, mass is kg. So, velocity is meter per second. So, we write kg meter per second. Kg meter per second is the momentum units. Right? So, if you do, okay, well, change in momentum, general government and the way they play now, change in momentum. So, change in momentum and then, so the final momentum minus initial momentum, change in momentum, we denote it as a delta P. So, which is nothing but final momentum minus initial momentum. Final momentum minus initial momentum is called the change in momentum. Clear? Understood everyone? Now, so, this is momentum. So, if you do, term in that, that is called impulse. Let's take the concept of impulse. So, impulse and intent. So, whenever a large force acts on a body, when a large force acts on a body, when a large force acts on a body for a very small amount of time. Very small amount of time. Small amount of time. So then that force into time is called the impulse. So okay. impulse, which is impulse, we denote it as the I. So it is a whatever the large force that is acting on the body, the average force acting on a body for a very small amount of time. Time. So average force into time taken in one. So simple example So cricketer So let's suppose Doni helicopter shot idea with them. So Doni helicopter shot got it So a very large amount of force acts on the ball will be very small amount of time. Bat key, ball key. So chala takko time contact total. So and a large amount of force is acting for the very small amount of time. 
so then it is called the impulse allotted so the impulse is equal to average goes into time so r we can write it as so f into so the very small amount of time we write it as the dt so the impulse is equal to f dt the impulse is equal to f dt clear so ante the impulse ni mana inkote ela gu rayochu ante so it is the force acting on the body if i take the force versus time graph if i take the force versus time graph so ila force versus time graph ila undu ankonni so the total force the average force acting on the body the total force acting on the body for very small amount of time so dani mana inkokala ela rasa ante integration from very t1 to t2 f dt integration t1 to t2 ante from time t1 nunchi t2 varaku so how much force enta force act out in body meda for small amount of time dt ante force anadi vary avutundi kada first ball nunchi bat indayinappudu koncham force apply avutundi so adi ball bat ni tagina tarvata inkoka force act avutundi avuna ante aa force anadi aa very small amount of time lone aa force anadi vary avutundi so manaki eppudaithe vary force undo impulse find cheyalante em cheyali so integrate cheyali ante na aa vary avutuna force ni manu integrate cheyali so the integration from t1 to t2 ఎంత టైం లో అయితే కాంటాక్ట్ లో ఉందో t1 టైం నుంచి t2 టైం వరకు కాంటాక్ట్ లో ఉందంట సో ద ఇంటిగ్రేషన్ t1 టు t2 f dt ఓకేనా క్లియర్ एवरीवन నౌ దిస్ ఇస్ ద చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ అండ్ దిస్ ఇస్ ద ఇంపల్స్ ఓకేనా దెన్ నౌ నౌ సి మీకు ఇంత ముందు ఒక కాన్సెప్ట్ చెప్పాను ఏంటది ఎప్పుడైతే మీకు ఇంటిగ్రేషన్ కాన్సెప్ట్ వచ్చిందో ఇక్కడ ఇంపల్స్ ని ఇంటిగ్రేషన్ ఆఫ్ టీ వన్ టు టీ టూ ఎఫ్ డిటి అని రాసాను సో ఎప్పుడైతే మనకు ఇంటిగ్రేషన్ సింబల్ కనిపిస్తే వాట్ ఈస్ ద మీనింగ్ ఆఫ్ ఇంటిగ్రేషన్ మనకి ఏరియా అండర్ ద కర్ అవునా సో ఏరియా అండర్ విచ్ కర్ ఇక్కడ ఎఫ్ అండ్ టైమ్ సో అంటే ద ఏరియా అండర్ ఏరియా అండర్ ఎఫ్ టి కర్ f t to results in the impulse remember this part so the area under f t to results in the imp impulse very important the area under manaku oka graph ichesi f t curve ichesi so find the impulse ante simple ga area under the curve find cheyandi so that we will get the impulse clear chal ee understood kada everyone ఇది ఐడియా ఉందా లెట్ సపోజ్ మీకు ఇంత ముందు ప్రీవియస్ గా కైనమాటిక్ చెప్పినప్పుడు యాక్సలరేషన్ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు ఇంటిగ్రేషన్ ఆఫ్ వి డిటి అని రాసి వెలాసిటీ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు ఇంటిగ్రేషన్ ఆఫ్ ఏ డిటి అని రాసి అంటే ఏంటి దీని మీనింగ్ ఏంటి సో ద ఏరియా అండర్ ఏరియా అండర్ ఏ టి కౌ ఏ టి కౌ రిజల్ట్స్ ఇన్ ద వెలాసిటీ అంతేనా ఏరియా అండర్ ఏటి కౌ రిజల్ట్స్ ఇన్ ద వెలాసిటీ సో సిమిలర్లీ ఇక్కడ ఏరియా అండర్ ఎఫ్ టి కౌ రిజల్ట్స్ ఇన్ ద ఇంపల్స్ నెక్స్ట్ నౌ నౌ సో లెట్స్ అండర్స్టాండ్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద రిలేషన్ బిట్వీన్ ది ఇంపల్స్ అండ్ చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ సో ఫైన్ ద లెట్స్ అండర్స్టాండ్ ద రిలేషన్ బిట్వీన్ ద రిలేషన్ బిట్వీన్ ఇన్ చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ delta p and impulse and rasko beta delta p and impulse i so ipudu first manaki change in momentum ante em cheppan so inta mundu newton second law define chesina appudu f is equals to dp by dt rasam avuna so f is equals to dp by dt so ikka nunchi dp is nothing but the change in momentum which i can write it as f dt which i can write it as fdt so manaki inta mundu impulse formula em cheppan cheppan meeku so i is equals to fdt impulse is also equals to fdt formula ante ra manaki ikkada impulse formula enti f into dt right so various change in momentum is also equals to fdt so ante ee rendu dinchi manaki em ardham avutundi so change in momentum ki formula fdt ni impulse ki formula fdt ni 
so from here shall i say the change in momentum is nothing but the impulse the change in momentum is nothing but the impulse other than the rounded relation the change in momentum is nothing but the impulse hope this concept is clear <coughs> chal next Copied everyone. So let's take one or two questions based on this. So you put a question is put now, children. So let's take one question. So consider there is a player. So a player in this moment, he is hitting the ball towards a wall. Is the wall and point. So he is hitting the ball towards a wall. So now first. A ball of mass m, or else let's suppose take some 0.5 kg ball in front of me. So a ball me is hitting towards a wall with some 10 meter per second in front of me. He is hitting the ball with some 10 meter per second towards the wall. So if you ball wall me that will inevitably reverse out that again. So consider without change in the speed, so the ball came back. So the without change in the speed and then it. 10 meter per second. मतलब 10 meter per second तो ना ball back को back हो चुकी है. So now my question is find find impulse imparted to the ball. Find the impulse imparted to the ball. So if impulse चला find जैसा चपड़ how do you find the impulse? So मतलब body mass ही चाहिए तो ना initial velocity चाहिए. So then final velocity चाहिए तो mass दें जी, हो ना? So इपुरो to find the impulse, shall I say the impulse is nothing but the change in momentum. The impulse is nothing but the change in momentum. So इक दें जी मनाओ change in momentum find ये अच्छा? How do you find the change in momentum? So the change in momentum is equals to change in momentum. Is equals to so it's a final momentum minus initial momentum. Final momentum minus initial momentum. So final momentum. I want to check. What is the final momentum? Block mass of change in ten. So zero point five into. So then final velocity. And that return of change. This is final. That is initial momentum. This is final momentum. So return of change. That is the velocity ten. So ten. माइनस टेन इसको अपना नहीं देखें तो ये लेफ्ट साइड होगा ना मोमेंटम लेफ्ट साइड उठा दो सो मोमेंटम मतलब ये वेक्टर क्वांटिटी यू शुड टेक विथ साइन विथ रेस्पेक्ट टू साइन आना है सो दैट्स व्हाई इट्स 0.5 इनटू माइनस टेन सो माइनस की माइनस इनिशियल मोमेंटम है वो तो चलने बॉडी मास हो चेसी so 0.5 into minus 10 into minus 5. So 0.5 into 10 into minus 5. So इधर चेसे minus 10. So minus 10 meter per minus 10 is the change in momentum. So if minus 10 change in the momentum, we can also say the same thing is the impulse. So the impulse is also the same. Then the change in momentum is nothing but the impulse. तो आप वेल वालो मैग्नीट्यूड है फाइंड जेबल आरंभ करना ऑप्शंस लो माइनस टेन है वो कौन-कौन डायरेक्ट टेन इच्छा आरंभ करना सो द इंपल्स इज़ इक्वल्स टू द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ़ द चेंज इन मोमेंटम इट इज़ इक्वल्स टू यू कैन राइट टेन न्यूटन सेकंड्स न्यूटन सेकंड राइट क्लियर अंडरस्टूड एवर इंपल्स में रहने तुम को क्वेश्चन इस तरह तुम्हारे सो कंसीडर
two seated zero. Let it be some two. Let this value be some four. So let this value be some six. Let it be eight. So this is a uh, time axis, and this is a force axis. Now let this be some. This will change three. So this will change the current integral. This is this is the value of some six and ten. So if it down, this will change to minus three. This is the minus three. Now, so we have to find we have to find the change in momentum. We have to find the change in momentum from zero to eight seconds. So zero to eight seconds will be change in momentum find here. So we go. Change in momentum and the change in momentum is nothing but impulse. I can say, how much change in momentum and the impulse. So if impulse, let us find this. Come on, impulse and the area under F T curve. Let us see. Area under F T curve will give the impulse. So I mean, the impulse which means that that is change in momentum. Right. So first impulse find this one. I mean, impulse is equal to Area under F T curve. So if we just want to let this area be A1, let this area be A2, let this area be A3. So if we now want to sign convention, so this call proper. So positive x-axis means on the area so plus this call plus A1. So below on the minus this call minus A2. Next to plus A3. You know. So direct one area this one add it and above on the positive, below on the negative this call. So here I am writing it as area of the first one. So the entire triangle, then. so triangle ki half into base, base under zero to two, which is two. Height which is six minus a two which is under so it can only take it two, it can only take it three. So under three into two rectangle number two. Breadth which is two, length which is three. <coughs> Next. A three and A three गुड़ों का रेक्टेंगल, so four to eight and four into इकन इंच करके three units, three units, so इकन इंच करके three units, so this comes out to be two two cancel six minus six plus twelve, so six six cancel twelve, so the impulse is equal to twelve, so माने impulse होती है ना तो the impulse is nothing but the change in momentum, माने वो आलरेडी इंटेंडेड, they ask us to find what is the change in momentum. सो मन को डैरक्ट एफ टी कव नीचे चेंज इन मूवेंट मन सो चेंज इन मूवेंट अंत इंपल का सो इंपल नथिंग बट एरिया अंडर द्लो सो फस्ट इंपल फैंड इंपल नथिंग बट चेंज इन मूवेंट सो विच इज ईक्वल टू ट्वेलवे ट्वेलव न्यूटन सैक चेज इन मूवेंट ओके सो दी सो इंको टाइप आफ क्वेश्चन अड़गे ऐसा So the collision of the ball with wall. So collision. You got the concept. The last concept for today's class. So that is the collision of ball with wall. So here, here we have wall and cone. Let us consider this is the wall. So this wall and cone. So here we have a ball and cone. This is a ball of mass m. So it's coming with some velocity v and hitting the wall. It's coming with some velocity v and hitting the wall. So consider this angle as theta. So the ball mali same velocity to ni, ball mali same velocity to ni ila bounce in that point. So let this angle be again theta. So let this be velocity v. So if we want to understand what is the change in the momentum, we can find the change in momentum. So if the body mass is there. Then velocity is there. The angle is there. So then find the change in momentum. I am asking. So I am asking. The first and foremost thing is that body is not straight line motion. No lead. That is the two D motion. That is the body is elastic. So this vector term. So if we arrange it, if we take this vector elastic, then we extend this one better. Extend this one. This theta is what? This theta is what? Okay. So this is the initial momentum. सो इनीय मूवेंट की वेक्टर कांपोने इनीय मूवेंट की वेक्टर कांपोने कांपोने दी मू वेलास्टी कांपोने इंको कांपोने सो टीटा इटी इधी एम वि 
కాస్ టీటా ఇటువైపు వస్తుంది ఇది ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఇటువైపు వస్తుంది అవునా సో వేరాస్ దీనికి సెకండ్ ఇది ఫైనల్ సో ఫైనల్ దానికి ఇటువైపు ఒక కాంపోనెంట్ ఇటువైపు ఒక కాంపోనెంట్ వస్తుంది సో టీటా ఇక్కడ ఉంది కాబట్టి మనకి ఇక్కడ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా కాంపోనెంట్ ఇటువైపు వచ్చేసి ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా కాంపోనెంట్ వస్తుంది రైట్ సో ఇప్పుడు ఇనిషియల్ మూమెంటం కి రాయండి ఇనిషియల్ మూమెంట్ ఇది ఇనిషియల్ మూమెంటం సో దాని కాంపోనెంట్స్ ఏంటి ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా సో ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా సో అది పాజిటివ్ ఎక్స్ యాక్సిస్ లో ఉంది కాబట్టి దాన్ని ఐ క్యాప్ అని రాస్తుంది ఓకేనా సో నెక్స్ట్ ఎంవి కాస్ట్ టీటా డౌన్ ఉంది కాబట్టి నెగిటివ్ తీసుకుంటున్నాం దాన్ని సో ఎంవి కాస్ట్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ సో ఇది ఇనిషియల్ మూమెంటం నో ఫైనల్ మూమెంటం కి అంటే ఆఫ్టర్ హిట్టింగ్ ద వాల్ ఫైనల్ మూమెంటం ఆఫ్టర్ హిట్టింగ్ ద బాల్ దిస్ ఈస్ వెలాస్టి వెక్టర్ సో ఫైనల్ మూమెంటం విల్ బి ఈక్వల్స్ టు లెఫ్ట్ సైడ్ వచ్చేసి మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ అంతే ఎందుకు మైనస్ లెఫ్ట్ కాబట్టి సో ఈ డౌన్ సైడ్ ఎంవి కాస్ట్ టీటా కూడా డౌన్ ఉంది కాబట్టి మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ట్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ సో అంటే దీన్ని ఎలా రాసుకోవచ్చు పిఎఫ్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ట్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ ఇది ఇనిషియల్ ఇది ఫైనల్ సో నాకు యూ హ్యావ్ టు ఫైండ్ ద చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ సో ఇక్కడ నుంచి చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ ఎలా ఫైండ్ చేస్తారు మనకి ఫార్ములా ఏమవుతుంది చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ ఏంటి ద డెల్టా పి ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు పిఎఫ్ మైనస్ పిఐ సో పి ఫైనల్ మైనస్ పి ఇనిషియల్ సో పి ఫైనల్ వచ్చేసి నెక్స్ట్ లైన్ లో రాసాం చూడండి డెల్టా పి ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు పిఎఫ్ మైనస్ పిఐ సో పిఎఫ్ వచ్చేసి మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ రైట్ అది పిఎఫ్ సో ఇప్పుడు పిఐ ఏంటి వాట్ ఈస్ దిఐ సో ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ సో ఇక్కడ నుంచి మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఇక్కడ మైనస్ మల్టిప్లై చేస్తున్నా నుంచి మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఆఫ్ మైనస్ ప్లస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ సో ఇక్కడ నుంచి మైనస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ ప్లస్ ఎంవి కాస్ టీటా జే క్యాప్ ఇట్స్ క్యాన్సిల్ సో ఇక్కడ చూడండి మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ మైనస్ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ సో విచ్ ఈస్ మీటింగ్ బట్ మైనస్ టూ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ సో దిస్ ఈస్ ద చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంటం ఫార్ములా వెన్ ఎ బాల్ హిట్స్ ద వాల్ ఎట్ అన్ యాంగిల్ టీటా అండ్ బౌన్సెస్ బ్యాక్ విత్ ద సేమ్ యాంగిల్ విత్ విత్ రెస్పెక్ట్ టు ద వర్టికల్ అండ్ విత్ ద సేమ్ వెన్ హాస్ క్లియర్ అప్ ఎవ్రీ వన్ సో జస్ట్ కాపీ ద మొత్తం కాపీ చేసుకోండి సో దీని బేస్డ్ ఒక సింపుల్ క్వశ్చన్ తీసుకున్నాను చూడండి కన్సిడర్ ఏ సింపుల్ క్వశ్చన్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ దిస్ సో జస్ట్ మీకు ఇప్పుడు వేరియబుల్స్ తో ఇచ్చాను వాటి ప్లేస్ లో ఇప్పుడు ఒక వాల్యూ సబ్స్టిట్యూట్ చేస్తానండి సో ఇది ఒక వాల్ అనుకోండి సో ఇక్కడ నుంచి ఒక బాల్ వస్తుంది సో కన్సిడర్ దిస్ ఈస్ ద బాల్ ఆఫ్ సమ్ సిక్స్ కేజీ మాస్ సో ఇది వచ్చేసి సమ్ థర్టీ డిగ్రీస్ యాంగిల్ తో హిట్ అవుతుంది అనుకోండి సో మళ్ళీ బాల్ వచ్చేసి ద సేమ్ సిక్స్ కేజీ బాల్ ఇట్ ఈస్ బౌన్సింగ్ బ్యాక్ దిస్ వే ఎట్ ద సేమ్ యాంగిల్ థర్టీ డిగ్రీస్ సో ఇప్పుడు ద చేంజ్ ఫైండ్ ద చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ ఆఫ్ మై క్వశ్చన్ ఈస్ ఫైండ్ ద చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ సో మీకు ఆల్రెడీ ఇక్కడ కాన్సెప్ట్ తెలుసు కదా సో వాట్స్ ద కాన్సెప్ట్ సో డెల్టా పి ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు మైనస్ టూ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ అంతేనా సో డెల్టా పి ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు మైనస్ టూ ఎంవి సైన్ టీటా ఐ క్యాప్ కదా ఫార్ములా మనకు ఫైనల్ ఫార్ములా వచ్చేసరి కదా సో జనరల్ గా మనకి ఇలాంటి క్వశ్చన్స్ ఇచ్చినప్పుడు ఏంటంటే సో దే ఓన్ గివ్ ద డైరెక్షన్ దే జస్ట్ ఆస్క్ అబౌట్ ద మ్యాగ్నిట్యూడ్ ఆఫ్ ద చేంజ్ ఇన్ మూమెంట్ సో ఒకవేళ మ్యాగ్నిట్యూడ్ అని అడిగారు అనుకోండి సో డైరెక్ట్ గా మీరు ఇలా తీసుకోవచ్చు టూ ఎంవి సైన్ టీ సో నో నీట్ టు టేక్ ద మైనస్ ఎంవి సో ఇక్కడ టూ ఇంటూ సో మాస్ వచ్చేసి సిక్స్ వెలాసిటీ ఇవ్వలేదా సో లెట్స్ టేక్ ద వెలాసిటీ ఆ సమ్ టెన్ మీటర్ పర్ సెకండ్ తోని ఇక్కడికి మళ్ళీ టెన్ మీటర్ పర్ సెకండ్ తోని బౌన్స్ అవుతుంది సో వెలాసిటీ వచ్చేసి టెన్ 
into sin 30 degrees. So 2 into 6 into 10 into sin 30 is 1 by 2. So 2 to cancel, this is going to be 60. 60 Newton seconds. This is the change in momentum. Clear? Understood everyone? This is how we can find the change in momentum. Clear? Check. So today we learned the first law of Newton motion, the second law of Newton's motion, and how to apply the Newton's second law, F is equals to M A. Right? We have seen some questions here. So Dantarwata, we discussed the change in momentum and what is the concept of impulse. So Eros discussion of concepts are very chala chala important, especially the Newton's second law and momentum and impulse concepts. Okay now. So Newton's first law chessy, it talks about the equilibrium. So Taroga questions practice and the compulsory Mirokasari video complete Araga compulsory questions practice shayali. So take the questions from your uh, textbook. Lay than the previous year question fees pony solve chain. Lay than the Mikaladi Kuna book suggestions and deep publications book on Temi Degara. So then load topic wise questions on time. So questions is pony compulsory practice chain. In the content, you learn the concept next to Nagoda. Problem solving is very, very important. So then it will compulsory number of questions, n number of questions. So solve chayali. Okay na? So with this, we'll wind up the class for today. So thank you guys. We'll meet in the next lecture.